Okay. Welcome back to Ordo Airsoft. Today we're going to be talking about a common issue with AEGs as especially guns that have a lot of use on them, a lot of wear. Um, this is just something that happens when the gun wears and uh, as a result you're going to have experience a drop in FPS, power, um, sometimes consistency and we're talking about the air seal. So if you this is kind of a junk gearbox we have lying around. So here's your cylinder here, this brass thing. And then this is your piston and your piston head. So this O-ring, now this is a junk uh, seal, so it's not in good shape. But this O-ring right here should seal against that brass cylinder. And this is... Uh, what produces all your power because if you don't have a seal here you're not going to push air out the nozzle which is going to result in low FPS so if you take this cylinder out here now this is the cylinder head right here you also make sure there's usually one or two o-rings on this here uh, usually those aren't as prone to leaking just because it's not moving like this piston head is so in order to check your air seal here, obviously you're going to have to take have to take apart the gearbox to do this test. But you're going to put your finger over the nozzle over here, over the cylinder head port. Where this is where all the gas or all the air gets compressed and out the barrel right here. This is where your hop up chamber goes on in your nozzle. So you're going to hold your finger over that so the air has nowhere to go and you're going to push the piston in like this. Now this one has a little bit of resistance but this seal is bad. Now you're going to, so that means that instead of the air getting trapped it's just pushing past the seal right here. So if this was a good seal here, like I've done this on the AK sitting over here, I've done this test on the AK and it has a perfect air seal. Um, you're going to put your finger over this and you're going to push this. You'll get probably halfway down the cylinder and it will not go anymore because the air is trapped in there and it's a good seal. It's not leaking anywhere. So a lot of times you want to just replace this O-ring and uh, you want to make sure your cylinder is nice and clean in there because if it has scoring and stuff it's not going to it's not going to seal well, it's going to tear apart O-rings. And you want to just lightly oil this stuff. Lightly oil. So you can see this one's worn, look at all the scoring in there. That's one of the reasons why this seal was worn out. This is just old parts we had lying around, just as an example. And uh, if you're wanting to get a little bit more FPS out of your gun, and you've checked your ER seal and it's good you can get different cylinders with different ports in them because um, obviously the smaller of the port the more air it's going to compress and they have different types of cylinders you can see this cylinder, the one I was showing it has no ports in it so it's just something you could do if you're looking to get more FPS out of your gun Obviously every gun's different. These are version 2 gearboxes and obviously the same thing's going to apply to like an AK gearbox here, a version 3 gearbox. You can uh, kind of see the cylinder in there, the little, that shiny thing. This is a ported cylinder as well. Oh, this is a fairly new gun so the air seal is perfect on it. You can also get different piston heads and stuff like that. But uh, doing this video because uh, we were getting some questions about people having low power out of their AEGs, and this is pretty common to have a bad air seal. And if the air is leaking past the O-ring, then that's just air that's not going, getting compressed and blowing out the nozzle which is powering your BB. So this is just a quick tip, something to look for, to check. If you have your gearbox apart, you might as well check it because it's not that expensive just to throw a new O-ring on the piston head and you could 
potentially see a pretty big FPS increase. So just something to check, and uh, we'll see you guys in the next video.